Okay, we are back, and this is the Lake Jeff City Part 2, broadcasting live in Jefferson City, Missouri, in the middle of the country where the floodwaters are on the rise. So we're looking at, uh, uh, actually I don't remember what was, uh, what was in there, but uh, I believe it was a parking lot, maybe? Yeah, there's a fence over there, if you can see that fence. But now we're going to look over here to the corner of Broadway and McCarty. There's the Truman Building as we can see. And then this is what we drove by in the last video. So now we're just going to get a little bit more of a close up and look out here and see what it looks like as we are able to walk in the middle of the street because the street is blocked off. You can't really get too far. I don't have to watch for oncoming traffic. We see the arrows here because uh, I don't think anybody can make it across this. It probably would cause issues with the vehicle. So here we are, the water is creeping up. I think today the level is um, 33 feet. Yeah, 33 feet. So this is a gorgeous little waterway. It kind of makes us seem like we are uh, in, what is it, Italy with the gondola boats and all that stuff. Uh, kind of cool now we still have we've got our little um, picnic tables here let's go check out the picnic tables and we have a new uh, you, you've basically got your dry ones and your wet ones so what you're gonna do now you're gonna have your picnic here for dry lunch and then um, if you're at work and you just want to take your shoes off and you go ahead and you use this table and sit on this side you get your feet wet now, if you want the more cooling effect, you can use our new uh, knee-high picnic tables where you're going to completely sit and have your legs uh, immersed in the pond. There's little things swimming around in here. There are probably fish. Check out the guardrail there. So this is just, it just looks gorgeous if this was normal. All right, somebody needs to put a muffler on that loud car. That's annoying. Somebody give him a ticket. Where's DMV when you need them? All right, so anyway, as I was saying, look at these signs, the street signs. We can see those uh, and where the intersection used to be. There is the <laughs> street sign over there. That's kind of neat. It's just, wow, it's just kind of breathtaking. It's hard to even imagine this uh, coming up so fast. You know, we just turn around and cleaning up tornado damage we're back to the flood of 95 I think the flood of 95 hit this level uh, 93 was worse than this I think it was 37 38 feet somewhere around there so there we have it crossing the street safely because nothing can hit me that's just kind of neat looking at our center stripes going underwater I'd like to get a boat it does smell fishy though. This is definitely not clean water. It's pretty stank. Okay, oh. it smells like creek water. Now, uh, you have to be careful because you can get, uh, there, there can be pathogens in standing water, even though this might be somewhat uh, freshly poured in from the storm drains because it comes up, the hydraulic head forcing water up from the storm drains is what is filling these area up areas up so look at the parking spaces look at the parking blocks it's kind of moved it so you can tell that water must be moving because some of those parking blocks are crooked so there we have it lake jefferson city part two gorgeous view down here on broadway street at highway 50. would y'all look at that we'll see you next time okay bonus footage looking at the state parking lot wow as the water has come up even further looking at the street in the distance there holy moly we have two more feet since that last video it has come up all right so let's flip on over here and see what's happening across the street and see if we can get a shot as we move up and overlook the other state lot where what has happened is they've had to break in and make a new entrance for this parking lot coming up here. Let's zip back over here to the other side. There we go. Checking out, coming up over the bridge here. Whoa. Oh man, that's just, oh, oh wow. 
Okay, so back on this side, what I was gonna tell you, they had to make a new entrance to this parking lot because you can't enter from this side. So they've had to come up here on the other side and actually break through the concrete to make another entrance so people can get into that lot. Oh man, that is even more breathtaking than it was yesterday. All right, that's what we have. We will come back again and update you this weekend and see if those waters come down or if they get any higher, hoping that they recede just a little bit. So we'll throw up a prayer and hope that uh, we dry out a little bit. We'll see you soon. CZTV coming back at you. Many more episodes to come. Getting back into the groove to tell you what's happening around Missouri. More fun stuff is lined up for your viewing pleasure. We'll see you.